Hey guys, my name is SigmaOT1 and welcome back to Skyward Sword 6 Heart Run. We're gonna start the first temple in the game today. Isn't that fun? I don't know. This can be kind of a confusing temple even though it's the first one in the game. There's not a lot of combat here, it's more puzzle oriented than anything. And also a little combat. And uh, one thing that is different about the temples in this game is that you can actually save within them and appear at certain points because there's like bird statues over there and the reason I paused was so I could get my wrist strap on actually. Alright. Slicey slicey! So smashy smashy, you get it? You get me? I don't actually have to go over here, I don't think, but I wanted to. To show you that there's stuff. Like these vines. Oh, oh, oh. 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 So that's what you're gonna do. Aren't you gonna puppy guard that, aren't you? Uh, so used to the upgraded version of the slingshot. I'll get into that later. But you can upgrade your equipment in this game, which I find to be exceptionally helpful, especially in regards to the slingshot. And also some other items, which we'll get into later, and maybe one that you might know from playing Smash 4, either the 3DS version or the, or the Wii U version. <sighs> Still don't have that game. I will someday, though. Where was the door that was unlocked? Uh, let's see. Oh, okay, it's at the beginning. So yeah, you do have to go this way, because there's... There's wood blocking the way. I hate when that happens. I hate when people try to keep me out like I'm a zombie. You know, the zombie apocalypse. Wait, where is the door? That's the door, right? Or is it? Man, I... You know what I mean when I say this temple is confusing? I guess I wasn't... But I guess I really wasn't paying attention to the door opening cutscene. I, I I make fun of that thing on occasion, but truth, fact of the matter is I need it in order to live. Okay, oh, okay, it's here. It's here, it's here. <sighs> Pay attention more often, Sigby, please. And the world will be forever grateful for this. Okay, this is an eye thing. This only actually appears in this temple. When, during the uh, like footage from the game, from trailers, I thought this was going to be a more common thing, but you confuse the eye by moving your sword. I think that much is known. That much is true. What else do we have in here? We have an amber relic. Just, just take take all this in. See if we can get that. We can't. Okay, never mind. Through the door we go. Because that is all we know. Those things. Those things don't get hit by them. They're gonna explode. They're gonna explode. Don't don't let them explode. And that gave us some slingshot ammo. Okay, they'll actually stick onto you and then they'll explode for minimal damage, I think. But you can, like, do a, a spin attack or one of these things in order to break it off. I don't even know if I've shown that yet, but that is a move you can do. Let's remove the spiders from the vines. Make our lives easier. This is the exact opposite of speedrunning tactics. Taking our time. <laughs> Alright. And we can create a shortcut. Die, wood! Die, wood! This isn't a zombie apocalypse. I told you that I wasn't gonna eat your brains. And we're not unreasonable. I mean, no one's gonna eat your eyes. I don't know why the staircase is here. I really don't. It's weird. Also, there's water down there. Ah! This guy a caveman. That's my cannon. He's a caveman. Oh, okay. Be, be afraid of my might. Why else am I locked door? Vines we can't reach. Oh wait, there's no water down here. There's water down here eventually. I think we can actually take care of that now. I think this is usually where I get stuck when I play this game. Actually, I know I can go into the door to the right, but I don't think there's anything to do there yet. No, I think... Yeah, there, there's a there's an alcove down here that I can go into, right? I, I'm not crazy, right? Game? Oh, right. There's a switch uh, over here. There's a lot of switches in this dungeon. Get used to it. I don't think it's the norm for there to be a lot of switches in these dungeons, but... That's what you're up against, and that's what you gotta do in order to beat the game. Find switches. Switches with old man snitches. 
Oh, and here's another one. So that unlocks that door right below it. Okay, you're giving me too many options. I, it's not gonna be a, a theme of this Let's Play me saying that the game is giving me too many options. It's like, what is this? Zelda 1? Or Link Between Worlds? I don't know. And if you ask me how I think of this game in comparison to Link Between Worlds, I I don't know which one I like better. They are unique. Ah! I was not careful. Hit, it, hit the spider like this. Hit him in the belly. The, oh, come on! Wow, that was weird. Alright. Now it's time for you to die. Now it's time for you to die. Spiders. Spiders. And yes, the Z targeting does work, even though you're using your pointer to aim. Aim. Oi, mate! Give me some hearts, mate! I, do I have any potions? Did I bring any potions? Well, I got the clear. Oh, okay. Right, I used the, the, the shield potion that I got already. Because I was nervous! There we go. Now you're dead. What do you have to say to me? Two doors lead to rooms left and right, but they will only open when the gemstone struck. One is above, one is below. That's supposed to give us a hint. It's a bit cryptic, and this is officially where I usually get stuck when I play this game. And usually working, looking at a walkthrough doesn't really help either, because, I, I don't know, I can't follow it for some reason. Okay. Vines! I have a Vine account. Follow me. I'm gonna make, I do things on the Vine account. I'm sure I have to get up there. Inaccessible down here. Can't reach. Can't be reached. Above and below, eh? Okay, so if you will look at the design of the room, you will see that there is another spider over there. It's a spider. I think there's also a another alcove on this side, or is that not so? We need to fill this room with water if we're gonna do anything, and we can't do it from here. So don't think. Put it out of way, Link. You don't need to slice any bad guys just yeah, they're not they're not really in sight. Blech. To the other door! Cause that is where the action is, I think. At least I hope, because otherwise I'm lost, and yes. It's it it sucks. But oh, oh, oh rupees! Rupees and nuts! I like nuts. I mm, I like nuts. Especially chestnuts roasting on an open fire because it's close to Christmas by the time this is going up. Oh, come on! That barely hit me. Ah. 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 Master, you're gonna die! Don't die, please, Master. I like you. I want to make. Oh. I I'm trying to hit the vines, by the way. I don't know. I hit the vine! Actually, I actually want to get to the middle of that. So, let's stop in place. Swing your partner round and round and hit him in the stomach with a sword! That's how we treat the world with sword play. And also, switches. Is this where we flood the room? Yep, this is how we flood the room, and I think this also affects the middle room and the room on the right. So we're in good shape. Thumbs up, I mean, a thumbs up to my computer. So Fi still wants to talk to us. Uh, yeah, I've been told by, I think, Chase. He's commented on some of my Zelda videos. Thank you, Chase. I I appreciate knowing that there's somebody who enjoys my my three heart runs, or six heart run in this case. Uh, he, he told me it's Fi. So, thank you, buddy. Thank you very much. And thank you for letting me kill the spider, even though you had nothing to do with that. And... Slice away, slice away. Also, thank you if you're watching. Thank you, Jacket, for commenting on some of my punch out videos. I like, I like to know that people are watching. Like I just said, ah, boom. You're you're gonna change it eventually. Speaking of boom, oh, uh, when I was prepared to do it the other way. Okay, I don't want to lose any more hearts. I, yeah, say boom as I recorded the Sonic Boom video yesterday when the same day it went up. It feels much better to play this game, because this game is much better. Yeah. Alright. The treasure chest over there. Uh, do I want to open it? I think this is the... I think this is a treasure map. I mean, it's not a treasure map, it's a dungeon map. Even if it is, like, a, a, heart, a piece of heart or something, it's not. Okay, good. 
So this game does something that not a lot of other Zelda games do. They actually combine the map and the compass. So you know where everything is. Including important things. Also... Yeah, see? Okay. Master, I have information for you. You have obtained a map from this area. You can view it by pressing black. The position of doors and their locks, as well as the position of status of treasure chests, can be confirmed on the map marks. Be aware, you will be unable to use beacons here. Yeah. That's true. Now this is actually neat. It shows you where locked doors are, it shows you where important stuff is with the exes. Usually compasses only show you the location of treasure chests, and this one shows you a bit more. And there, there's also a similar thing in Link's Awakening where there's a pinging sound of some kind when you're in the same room as a key, which I also find very useful. Actually... Is this filled with water? Oh. Mm. Yeah, it is, it is. It's filled with water! You like water, don't you? Now we can actually go to that room. Can we go to this? Is this the room we can go to? I'm trying to dive. No. no. I'm, I'm used to having... I'm, I'm used to... Uh, I, I almost spoiled something. Never mind. I'm used to being able to dive underwater, but I can't because I don't have. I can't. I haven't met the requirements yet. Yeah. Oh, yeah, my TV's gonna shut down because it's not showing anything. I, mean, I don't know if you're supposed to be able to see your display on your TV when you're recording Let's Plays. So. But, uh, I cannot. I don't have any splitters of any kind. So. Guess it, I didn't have to go back to this room. Guess I did not. Guess I didn't. Oh, there's a switch up here. I forgot about. Ah, uh, jeez. So, if, if you're following along, I'm sorry for leading you astray and making you miss that switch. I. Then again, I, it would be a little inconvenient to try to play the game and also have watch me at the same time due to how involved it is. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, never mind. I, I keep on thinking I have equipment that I don't. Why why do I keep thinking that? I, I am way too used to having everything. I gotta I gotta remember I don't have everything. I I don't have anything tonight. Or something like that. That's that's how the, the song goes, right? The the one with Pitbull and Neo. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's actually go the way we're supposed to go. Is there any point to filling that room with water? Can I remember any reason to fill the room with water? Okay. Is that over there, I guess? Can I reach it? Is it anything I need? Want slash want? Do I want it? You gotta want it. Well, I can, I can access it through here, that's right. Okay. So let's do that before moving on to the main room, because I'm sure it'll be helpful to do. As is exploring every nook and cranny and dungeons in every other Zelda game. And hold on, the the uh, there's a thing. The thing that dangles from my Wii Motion Plus, because I don't have one of the Wii remotes that has that built in. That's at my house as opposed to my college dorm. Cause I I, I want my brother to use it, isn't I? Cause I want to be nice. He needs it more than I do, I guess. I'm gonna play that Wii Sports Resort, which he actually does play from time to time. A basketball game. It's fine. Give me that heart. And both of you. You need to confuse them at the same time or it won't count. They're rolling their eyes at me because they're sick of my crap. That's my that's my logic. And I'm gonna stick with it. I need a key. That's right. That's what this is. This is a key. Right? It's not a, it's not a piece of heart. Even if it was, again, I got... whatever. If... Pieces of hearts, you need four of them in order to fill a heart container. Much like in every other Zelda game except for Twilight Princess, which requires five. So, yeah. So, yeah! Alright. Dive! Now that I think about it, I don't think there's actually a reason to fill this room with water. At least not one that I remember. Okay, so I got past the part where I usually get stuck in this temple and I did it without any help, so... I appreciate that, Brain. Thank you for remembering this dungeon enough to not have to 
check a walkthrough during recording. All right. Through the thing we go. I'm glad I remembered to get the key before coming over here. All right, this next part, I believe, will take up the bulk of the dungeon. Let's take a quick look. It's this main room here. I have to go to the side. And then over there, where Princess Zelda is. Or at least her aura, according to the map. Oh no, oh no. I'm not doing any cutscene showing me how grand this room is. I don't care. I don't give a crap. I don't give... Mm. Let's go get a bird statue. Smashing! Look at all these things. They're like crates hanging from the ground. How are we gonna remove them? Also, switch. I need to recenter my Wii remote. Yeah, almost, almost got it. There we go. Alright, alright. Into that room we go. It must be something very. Uh, Oh, I took my nunchuck too much. Oh well. Oh well. What a nunchuck plus work. N nunchuck motion plus, I don't know. Uh oh! Mini boss time! Because that's what this usually means. We got a scout, folks. Nice. Recurring enemy in the game? These guys. Well, they have two swords. They. Do I have to explain how to fight them? Just slice where he's not holding his swords. Or else, if you take too long, he will strike you. Or if he blocks. Or. Uh, yeah, see, he's gonna strike. But he did- he missed! He missed. He's a Stephen King novel that turned into a movie that- uh, I don't know. There's a lot of Stephen King movies turned into no to movies. Like, The Shining, obviously, Carrie, like, three times, for some reason, and then there's Maximum Overdrive, which he directed, which I thought- I found that to be hilarious that he directed that movie. Okay! Well, I haven't seen any of the movies. I want to see The Shining someday. Why am I talking about Stephen King when I just got the Beetle? Yes, the Beetle. One of the most feared items in Super Smash Bros. for 3DS and Wii U. It, it gotta start here. Yeah. I, I like this item a lot, actually. This is an item that's unlike anything else that they've done in the Zelda series. It's basically an extension of yourself. You have acquired a new item. Analysis from this object's insect-like profile and wings indicates it can fly. Okay, great. Tilt the Wii Remote to remotely pilot the device. The sharp structure of the front of the device can sever threads and deliver a blow to smaller objects. To launch the device, bleh, tutorials. Thanks for the tutorials, Fi. Okay. We gotta get out of this room. You know how it works in Zelda. In order to get out of a room, you need to use the item that you get from defeating the mini-boss. And I gotcha. Oh man, I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha, 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 I gotcha, I gotcha, I got the room open. And it goes back to you once it's done. If it hits a wall too much or an enemy attacks, it'll return to you. Actually, no, I think about it, it's kind of like the Seedles in Wind Waker, except you don't need to buy a bunch of ploy parries, or however that's pronounced, in order to control it. And, yeah, you, know, you use motion controls in order to steer it, but that doesn't bother me. I think it works quite well. I broke a crate! money. Also, any money that it collects, it will bring back to you. Or passes over, I don't know. I don't know what the correct terminology is. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, see, it, it it broke. It never be- it doesn't need to be repaired by, like the shield, though, which I appreciate, because while the shield is sometimes not really required to beat a dungeon, the beetle usually is, actually. We unlocked that door. Also, I want to show you something in case you're not doing a three hard- I mean, six hard run like me. Uh, six hearts? This game should never have given you six hearts because it's confusing the crap out of me! Why am I saying crap? It makes me sound immature. Okay, whatever. Piece of hearts. Want to know how to get it? Aim the beetle into a switch that is located in the top of that tower. Okay, now you know it, I don't have to do it. And I can save time as a result. I'm gonna have to get a key from over there. In fact, let's let's save again. Alrighty, uh the That's what happens when you don't prepare when you can save ahead of time. Alright, trust me, I've been there. Everybody has been there. Everybody nobody can talk perfectly one hundred percent of the time. You you gotta you gotta trust me on that. It's impossible. Okay, I fell down the stairs. Don't, don't get me out of this nightmare. Thank you. 
actually walk up the stairs like a gentleman. And explore. Alright. Let's get up. There. Oh, no, not quite. Not quite, Link. You, you were close, but you didn't... It, you, you, you didn't do it, right? Uh, 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 uh. Oh, wait. Yeah, I get it. I can't do that yet. I need to go into this room in order to do the thing. In order to go above and beyond. Okay, you're locking me in a room. Okay, I hate getting locked into stuff. It's like, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm in prison. Oh, you, for this, flip it like this. Do a fatal blow. <laughs> flip it from underneath. Yeah. That's what I like. That's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, I like it. And I open the door. We have unfinished business in here now, don't we? Don't we? This crate needs to go. No, I'm kidding. That's not what we need. Well, wait, it is what we need, actually. I, I forgot, I forgot. I thought it was a wooden crate, but nah, nah, you, you actually have to do it. So really, the, uh, the crates in the main room are a good preparation for this thing. You see those eye things? They can't see us if we're on the ground. We need to be a little high up for it to see us. Yeah, push it more to the center. Uh, it's kind of hard to tell where this resides spatially. Right here. Maybe that'll be... I mean, I need to get a little closer. Let's see. Only one of the... Only one of it sees us. Sees... Okay, that should do. And if it doesn't, then I can always move it a little more. Okay, I'm not trying to do that, I'm trying to run it up it. Alright. Spin your sword around and round and spin the eyeballs to the ground. I, lo I love doing that. It's like, that's the last time in this game you have to do that, actually. I heard people were afraid that they that was gonna be that was gonna be an overused gimmick, but no, it's only in the first temple, so you can either be thankful that it wasn't overused or thank or disappointed that it was underused. I don't know. There's plenty of other motion-centric actions you can do in this game. Many of which I've already shown. Yeah, never mind. Let's get back. Let's get out! I dropped my nun suck. And I'm a vampire. Can I get up there now? Can I get up there now? How do I get up there? I am at a loss for my memory how to get up there. Maybe my beetle will shed some light into the situation. I think you need to. I actually think now that I think about it, think, think, think. You need to hit a switch in order to lower the water. I mean, raise the water level so that you can get up here. So yeah, slam a lamb ding dong into my heart. I don't know why it's my heart that you're slam a lamb ding donging into, but stop it. Stop slamming lemma ding donging everywhere. Jeez. Okay. You know what you can do when you actually remember what your arsenal of weapons is? Stuff like that. You can do that. Okay. Okay. Flip the spider, and yeah, I'm telling you how to do things that I already told you how to do. I'm rehashing. I don't know. That should have counted. And that did count stuff. Thank you. I don't care though. Slice the trees, not the trees on um, like their f I don't know. But the hoax can't help their feelings if they like the way they're made. And they wonder why the maples can't be happy in their shade. 